the definition of an NFL Hall of Fame football player is a player that you can't tell the story of NFL football without. So tell me how the hell you gonna tell the story of the NFL without Cliff Branch. He had the numbers for his time. They compare favorably to guys like Lynn Swan of the Pittsburgh Steelers and Bob Hayes and Drew Pearson of the Dallas Cowboys. He has all the memorable plays you can think of with all the deep balls he's caught. Fittingly enough, he's in a tie for the longest reception in NFL history, and it can only be tied, not broken, as it was 99 yards. And he has the hardware as he helped the Oakland and LA Raiders win three Super Bowls. And we can talk about 40 times and track times all we want, as he has those. I've seen him blow by Daryl Green, one of the fastest men to ever walk this planet, as if he was just standing there. His speed scared guys to death and opened things up for tight end Dave Casper and fellow receiver Fred Blitnikoff, both Hall of Famers. Stuff like that makes me wonder why it took so long to get Branch in. God rest his soul, he definitely should have gotten in while he was alive, but at least he's in now. Congratulations. I know you're up there enjoying what you had coming while you were still here. Branch was a small receiver, but make no mistake about it. He went up, fought for, and got those 50-50 balls. He blew by Daryl Green when he was an old man. So when he was younger, oh man, forget about it. And while being fast is great, you're not a deep threat unless you can catch it. And you can't catch it unless you can track it. And Branch always seemed to know where that thing was coming down. For my money, Branch is the greatest deep threat in NFL history. He made a place for the smaller, faster receiver. The idea of what guys like Deshaun Jackson and Tyreek Hill would be all came from Cliff Branch. Branch's eligibility started in the 90s. So this is the beginning of his fourth decade fighting to get into the Hall of Fame. And he's in now, so he can truly rest in peace. Hall of Fame or no Hall of Fame, he's always been a Raider legend. But now we celebrate because a great player got his just due. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time.